Hello guys, in this video we'll tell you how to fix the app didn't start in the required time error in Windows 10 or 11. But before we start the video guys, if you have any computer or software related problems, please feel free to contact us by visiting our website and using the submit a problem button from there. Or alternatively, you can also comment down below on our videos about your problem and just don't worry, we'll make a video for you to resolve it. Number 1. Update the application. For this, open the Microsoft Store app and from there, go to the library tab. Now, click the get updates option in the top right corner. Now, if an update for the problematic application is available, just click on the update button to install it. Number 2. Run the Windows Troubleshooter for application. For this, right click on the Windows icon and from there, select settings from the list. Now in system tab, just go to the troubleshoot option and click on the other troubleshooters option. And from there, click the run button next to the Windows Store app. Number 3. Enable automatic date and time option. For this, ensure that your system's date and time settings are correct. Incorrect date and time settings can sometimes cause the app didn't start in the required time issues with the Microsoft Store. Number 4. Perform the clean boot. Clean Boot is a troubleshooting approach in Windows that allows you to start a computer with a limited collection of launch program services. Number 5. Alternatively, you can also check for Windows updates. Number 6. Scan for viruses and malware. Malware and viruses can cause the app didn't start in the required time problem message. To check for issues, just conduct a complete computer scan using an authorized antivirus or anti-malware tool. So this was it for the video guys. We hope this video helped you solve your problem. If it did, then make sure that you give this video a like and subscribe to the channel. And if it did not, then don't worry. Just comment down below the issue and we'll try to figure out what is wrong with your specific case. Thank you for watching.